South Ayrshire Council is delighted to support the RBS Ayrshire Rugby Development Cup. Well done to all the teams who have reached the finals. Brought to you by Keenan of Air. Whatever your needs, Keenan of Air will get you there. We're at Mill Bray for the Ayrshire Schools Development League finals night. And in the senior final, Mark College Development 15, coached by John Sharkey. Take on the Carrick Academy Plus 15, coached by that stalwart hooker, Gordon Brown. And early on, Mark put on the pressure. Great take there by Scott Lambert in the line out. All back to Tommy Gaunt. Putting the standoff away. Oh, and lovely wee shimmy there by Connor Bickerstaff. Ball popped up to Ian Kerr, but Kerr thrown into touch, getting the ball back. But Bickerstaff in support, but taken out by the Carrick defence. Put down field by Carrick's Greg Montgomery. And ball run back by Lanker Fraser Grant. Crashed into touch there by the Carrick defence. Ball inside. Carrick looking for the turnover, but back on the Mar side. Whoa, what a tackle there. And this time Carrick getting the turnover. And it's Ross Knight who comes away with the ball. Carrick forwards. Piling in there. But a crafty wee steal by Marto in the turnover. Gaunt putting Kyle Valance away. Mar forwards arriving in numbers. Again, quick ball. Out to Bickerstaff, Bickerstaff. Spotting a wee gap, popping it down there. Great take by David Logan. Oh, but taken out in midair there by Josh McInnes. And referee Finlay Clark spotted that one. Back for the penalty. Carrick still in possession. Out to midfield. Ross Knight taking the ball into the heart of the... Mar defence, and great run and flip out the back door there by Prop Craig Davison, and that put Ross McCulloch away down the wing, lovely wee chip forward, this is the closest Carrick had come to the Mar line, Ian Kerr trying to run it out of his own 22, but running straight into the tackle of Greg Montgomery, Carrick arriving there in numbers, desperate for the turnover, and the ball safely back in the Mar side. And the kick not finding touch, only finding David Logan, who got his own back there on Josh McInnes for that mid-air tackle, but then spilled the ball into the Mar 22. And Mar Hooker, Richard McNichol, laying the ball back for prop Mark Allison. And hey, there's a fair old turn of pace for a front row man. Great hands from the Mar backs out to the wing, but yet again... The attack foiled by great defence on the halfway line by Carrick. Carrick forwards working away there. And this time they got the turnover. Joe Cree hauling bodies out of there like a, a nightclub bouncer. And it's coming back on the Carrick side forwards, driving on, making the hard yards round the fringes. Ball out to Ross Knight, Knight to... Montgomery and whoa, what a break by the carry standoff. Was he going to go all the way? Was this going to be a try in the last play of the first half? No. But a great 35 minutes must have impressed Provost Winifred Sloan. I'm delighted to give support to, to the young people and to the rugby club because at one time there weren't so many young people playing rugby. Now it's great to see it getting back into the schools. South Ayrshire Council is delighted to support the RBS Ayrshire Rugby Development Cup. Well done to all the teams who have reached the finals. Brought to you by Keenan of Air. Whatever your needs, Keenan of Air will get you there. Nothing each at half time. You could tell how much the crowd were appreciating this one. 
Early in the second half, though, it was Olmar deep inside. The Carrick 22. Lovely wee dummy there by Connor Bickerstaff. The man on the end of the pass was Mark Tracy, right under the post. And that was a beautifully worked try, straight off the training paddock. Tracy, no problem, converting his own try. And suddenly, Mar edge ahead, seven points to nil. Bickerstaff again. That looked just a wee bit like crossing there. It certainly was, the referee Finlay Clark. And this is a chance for Carrick to get on the board. And no mistake by winger David Logan. Seven points to three. And still all to play for. Joe Cree to Greg Montgomery. Montgomery well pleased by the Mar College back row. Laying the ball back. Popped up to centre Ross Knight. Knight knocked over and again. Mar piling in there. Winning the penalty for holding on. And no problem for Mark Tracy to slide the lead to Mark Colley Development 15 10. Eric 3. Eric Van going to give up on this one though. And once they got their big men motoring, well, they are serious questions of the Mark Colley's defence. Then McClark seen the penalty. Carrick keeps the ball, but with that tackle in Montgomery, advantage over, bring it back, line it up for the penalty, and David Logan reduced the margin to only four points with 12 minutes to go. Greg Montgomery, we fumble there on that look with centre Ross Knight. Another wee fumble this time, it's snaffled up by Maher, and off goes... Ian Kerr down the wing, inside ball. This time it's recovered by the Carrick defence. What a pace this game's been played at. And these Carrick guys having to defend out of their skins to keep Marr out as the game entered the closing stages. Marr swarming in on that ball. Again out to Bickerstaff. Bickerstaff hauled down there by Lyle Cairns. But Mar had got themselves a penalty. Carrick offside. And Mark Tracy, no problem, landing his second penalty. Carrick, well, they were prepared to fight right to the end because a converted try would have taken the game into extra time. And they fought and they struggled and they put in a terrific amount of effort. But the Mar defence held right to the end on their own 22 desperate ball for Carrick to win but go to ground Finlay Clark keeping a very sharp eye on it having a good look there and well it is a turnover for Marr there was a Carrick hand in there I think yes penalty to Marr oh no to the Carrick boys come on ref no arguing though Final play of the game. Ball goes to Tracy. Tracy bangs the ball into touch. That's the final play. And Marr delighted to have retained the trophy. You can see the despair on the Carrick boys' face. What a cracking match. Connor, well done, but my goodness, Carrick made you work for that win, didn't they? Yeah, played all right some parts, but quite scrappy most of the game. Didn't play our best rugby. They were all over us up front, hitting the rocks and that, but... Managed to scrape through and get the win, what's the main thing? So And you've retained the trophy, you must you must feel good about that. Yeah, it's always good to win it again. You know, if we lost I don't think the boys would be very happy, you know, so it's always good to win again. So Mark Colley's retained the trophy. It's been a great night's rugby here at Millbray. All credit to Greg Sinclair, Damien Kelly and Stephen Main, the development officers who put it together. This is Ron Evans for Scottish Rugby Television at Millbray. South Ayrshire Council is delighted to support the RBS Ayrshire Rugby Development Cup. Well done to all the teams who have reached the finals. Brought to you by Keenan of Air. Whatever your needs, Keenan of Air will get you there.